One, two, three, go. Five, that's it. Okay? Yes. And the more you lean forward, the, the less you're going to nice. feel this push to sit down. We go from here or from here? We go from here. Okay. Just step back a bit, please. This is a glider. It's a very cool feeling, man. Ah. So, Mark, yes, again, you're going to walk. Walk. You're going to lean forward. You will not stop. Not stop. And for God's sake, don't sit down. Resist say. if you feel this. Just resist it. Okay. Keep walking, and next thing, we're fine. Okay. Okay, please come here. Uh, brother, brother. Your name? Mark? Pass your hand through there. But when I'm in the air, I could sit, right? Yes. But not when we fly. No, keep keep going. Okay. Brot. Give me the camera, let me extend it for you. It's already on? Yes. On. Okay.
used to do that in England? Eh? You used to do this in England? Oh, I tried to do a hang gliding course oh. and I couldn't finish because of the rain. at the helicopter part? Eh? We land at the edge? We land there, yes. We, we, we. Have you ever landed in water? Hey? Have you ever had a bad wind and you landed in water? No, you can't land in the water. No. You can drown. Because <laughs> you're going to get tangled in the lines. You yeah. Know? It's not a good idea. You lose your glider. It becomes worthless. It has a certain uh, layer of protection. Keep it uh, holding the air. You land in the I think I... <laughs> what is the beach called over here? Okay. This, what is it called? The beach called over here? Pepino San Cojado. Pepino San Cojado. That's the view, man. <laughs> Why are we not going? I thought we'd be going down a little bit no, faster. No, no. Don't you want to stay out a bit? Huh? No, I don't want to bit. Okay. <laughs> Let's we, stay here a bit. We can stay here all day. Okay. <laughs> uh, now I'm just thinking. Another one coming. Ah, I think this is uh, the guy in the wheelchair. Yeah. And this guy over here is in a wheelchair. Hey. Eh? Now it's talking to the camera. Uh, okay. sorry, sorry. So if we could do it, you could do it. Coming out here, man. Ah! 
na pie. It's funny how that works, huh? They share the same beach. <laughs> Millionaires and billionaires <laughs> over here. And the slums over there. It's really how that works over here. And we all come by the beach to hang out. We all meet by the beach. was a nice fight and this spot man right here ah. so can you go up from down here hey can you go up from down here what do you mean like if you if the wind could pick you up right mm -hmm. so can you pick up from no. now no i thought that's what he was doing no he's, he's a student he's learning Okay. Just taking a lesson. Oh. So my men here learning how to flight. I guess we got some more license to get. So it could fly, man. Because I would definitely like to fly. Matter of fact, I would love to fly. Ah. Boom. So this is why we lose. What is it called? A variometer. See, we took off from there. It tracks you. Yes. Yeah. It's a tracker. How long we was up there for? We were there for. Air time, twenty-two minutes. 22 minutes oh what's the average eight to ten eight to ten minutes yeah and we got 22 minutes <laughs> that's when i say you're a good energy thank you the... yeah the guy uh, we... god is good to us today yes 
That's the African spirit. It is. I'm very much connected with him. I wake up in the morning, I turn around, put my feet on the ground in bed, and I say, Thanks God. Thank you for another day. All glory to the He's very man kind above. to me. He's I think very he's, kind to me. Yes. He's so generous. They said generous to our world. The other day I was I'm a Muslim, huh? So yeah. I'm a Muslim. Okay. So I have my carpet at home. I like to pray in the morning. Yeah. I don't pray five times a day because it's very difficult here in Brazil. But I like when I wake up I have my grips and I open my carpet. The other day I got so in in touch with him. Oh it's like a race. A race to the goal. With different waypoints. That's nice. Very nice. Mother tried for the first time acai. Jair! And? That's some nice. That is you want it with the acai cooking banana, banana or banana? There is, you can beat inside it banana or strawberry. Banana or strawberry? Yeah. Batido dentro, boy. Eh? Batido, mix. Yeah. Banana. Banana, banana would be better. Okay. Um com banana, um sem nada para mim, sem frutas. Dois. Pequenos. Yeah. And that's going to be my first time trying acai. He was telling me it's better to try it here. Then there's a place over there, which is like a franchise, and it's very Americanized. So I'm about to try the real Rio acai. It's like the difference between a hamburger from the Hard Rock Cafe and McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> and this is, this would be, the one over there would be McDonald's, because they're franchise. And you know, I don't like franchise. But we, we are by the beach. Ah. Oh. I'm probably going to walk that later. What is it like? I've hear about it, but I never really thought what like acai. Acai, it's a berry. It's it's a berry. Yeah, I've seen I've seen the uh, video of like the where they're getting it yes, from the tree. Yes, it's a berry in the northeast of Brazil, and uh, and then and then they they mash it all up, oh. and uh, and they they add uh, syrup to it called syrup. Guarana syrup. It's a very sweet syrup from uh, a Brazilian fruit also. Yeah. And it becomes a Okay. Boom, check this out. It's cold. This is acai. Trying acai for the first time. What you have you what do you have in yours? Hmm. This is yours. Oh. Strawberry. Ah. Ooh. This is you, eh? Yeah. I'm trying to see what it tastes like. It's very good, but I can't. I'm trying to explain to them how it tastes like. I understand. What do you have in yours? Nothing. Just Nothing. guarana and the syrup. For you, you you have strawberry. Strawberry. Oh, I should I should have tried it just like that first. All right. Hold on. nice with the fruit. 
Yeah, it's 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 nice. Yeah, I know. And it's cold. It's very nourishing. It's very nourishing. Okay. Oh, nourishing. Yeah. Yeah. In the morning, there is it. Sometimes I come when I'm coming with my electric bike. There's a place that sells natural things, like fruits and things and natural things, yeah. and they have a drink made of this. Really? It's like um, you can drink. It. So I buy a small one in the morning. It gives me a bit of energy okay. for the day. Uh, I can see why people are addicted to this. I would definitely have that, like on a daily basis. Very good. Now we're done having our acai. It was actually pretty good. And Mr. Akmath, I think, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna fuck up his name because I can't pronounce his name. But I'll put his Instagram in the, in the link. If you want to come here and want to fly, you should fly with him, man. He's a pretty nice guy. We had a good time. We shared an acai afterwards. He told me about the city, which I needed to know. And now we at the beach. I'm probably going to spend a couple of minutes over here and then go to uh, the biggest market in Rio. That's the goal today, after after here. That's the goal today. But I'm, I'm already loving the view over here. <laughs> I, might, I might not leave. So, ah. I got to take these shits off. Yeah. It's better like this. And the sun. It's so soft. I fucking love it. Get further away from so I used to live my first week I spent it I've been here for like a week and two days now and my first week I spent it in Baja de Tijuca which was more of a quiet area and more of the rich side I didn't really like it because I wanted to be active, get out, and every time I would want to go do something, everything would be further away, about 30 to, uh, to an hour away. So, I couldn't, I didn't want to extend over there. So I ended up going to, of course, Copacabana, which I feel like it's a cool place. To visit but to live there I wouldn't recommend it I don't like it the streets where I live at as soon as you step out you see dog shit everywhere it smells like fucking piss and but it's active it's active 24 7 which I love over here it's like any other where in rio they are active at, at like uh 24 7 but in in copacabana they active like i'm talking about like <laughs> active active 
and the amount the amount of homeless people that is over there is concerning ah. but i'll live here in a couple of days so i'm i'm only going to be in, in copacabana for about two more days then we go to sao paulo so y'all should have watch out for that vlog we're going to sao paulo to see what sao paulo look like and then i don't know where we go next we figured we figured out figured it out along the way ha. But over here, I forgot what's the... Oh, why is the name of the praia? Here. Si. San Corrado. Pepino, area do povo. Pepino. 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 São Corrado Pepino. São Corrado Pepino. Isso aí. Ah, valeu. Valeu. E você? Tchau. Você é que? Não entende. Você é de qual país? É, Haiti. Haiti. Sim. Meu Deus, que lacho. Que? Não, tem não. <risos> Perguntou se tinha guerra lá. Então, é. Não. Tchau. Valeu. Tchau. Ah. Mas yeah. sim. We in San Corrado, Pepino, which I love it. I think it's a lesser known area. It's not much. Uh, it's not like it's not like Baja de Tijuca. Baja de Tijuca was nicer, but I feel like here is a better vibe because the people over here are a lot younger. I think. At, at by the faces you could tell they're a lot younger and they're a lot nicer i mean out, outgoing not nicer they're a lot outgoing than by how to buy the chihuka where it is like i went to a fucking restaurant there was <laughs> i was probably the youngest over there i was with a friend of mine and i was definitely the youngest over there everybody over there was bald wrinkly and what have white out here so this is why i didn't like it much ah. well we had the beach as you can see people sunbathing ah. I like it man there's not much vendors over here I guess if you want something you gotta go to one of these spots to get it Popino I think this is a better area overall. Ah. And of course they play in I keep forgetting the name of it but it's basically football with uh, volleyball rules Oh yeah, I think this is 
about it on this side and when you cross over there there's another one but yeah I don't want to cross over there. Let me see. Boom. I'm guessing they have some type of club going on here. As you can see. As you can see. I wonder what that game is. Yes. Tennis. I guess it's tennis for volleyball rules. After all, I think everything over here, every fucking sport is modified to volleyball. But yeah, but I think it's time. No more beaches. Let's go to the biggest street marketplace in Rio.